game fish tagging program is about an ang collecting angler assisted data on recreationally important marine fin fish species. And Claude Bain of the VMRC and John Lucy started the program about 16 years ago, trying to collect data on these species of fish that didn't already have research programs associated with them. But the relevance of hot ditch is it's an important overwintering site for fish in the Chesapeake Bay, in particular red drum and speckled trout, and that's what we're trying to capture today. The power plant initiated a policy in October of last year to switch to catch and release only fishing here. And the feeling is that that's going to be important or have beneficial effects for the fish that overwinter here because a lot of them are a good size and potentially within the range that could have reproductive potential. The tagging program, the Virginia Game Fish Tagging Program, is really special because it allows each angler that participates or even people that recapture the tagged fish to get the story for the fish that have tags in them. Um, you get important information about where they move and where they're captured and how much they've grown. So ultimately we hope that some of those data that are collected can feed back into perhaps some management decisions. And then I give it a little gentle tug to make sure it's there, verify the tag number again, 09. We got the size, and now I'm gonna let this fish go. I've had some really interesting tag returns. Uh, I had a speckled trout come uh, return from uh, Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, and I had a redfish return from uh, a place called Woods Creek in uh, North Carolina, and I believe that's down around Moorhead City. But it's it's always interesting.